Hey everyone, welcome back here to the channel. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. Today is Monday, the brand new start of a new week. Some new information has just been leaked, guys, about the V29.10 update that's going to be dropping tomorrow. And let me tell you guys some real exciting news regarding Team Avatar officially coming to Fortnite. A trailer was just dropped as soon as I started recording this video, so I got some time to put that trailer in, guys, and you're probably seeing it on screen right now. So we're breaking down all of the information, guys. Let me know your thoughts down below of what you actually actually think of all the cosmetics that's actually coming inside of the game. Nobody hasn't really seen Asaka. We got a little teaser of Zuko, Katara, and Toph, plus Aang, you know, and Appa as well, but nobody has seen Asaka, guys. So I'm not really sure if this is basically just a teaser. As as we saw, it's basically like an 11 second uh, clip. So I'm thinking this is the teaser and we are going to be getting the official trailer tomorrow. So let me know your thoughts down below, guys. I'm very, very hyped for this uh, new collaboration here inside of Fortnite, guys hope we get Sokka that's a must but we are going to be breaking down some information what to expect in tomorrow's v29.20 update as what the tweet is saying from eye for monkey on a twitter some more stuff regarding cars are basically going to be popping up inside of the game so there's a possibility guys once you do log into game tomorrow you are going to be seeing some cosmetics from rocket league imported into fortnite that's if those said cosmetics are cross-platform cosmetics similar to the bugatti Santa daisy car as what uh, eye for monkey is actually suggesting potentially the Bugatti car as it got the cross game tag in Rocket League it will likely be inside of Fortnite if you do own this car in Rocket League it should pop up in Fortnite uh, tomorrow as well but some other information basically talking about Rocket Racing ranked progression is going to be tweaked based on your user uh, feedback and some new ranked rewards is probably going to be popping up inside of the game regarding Rocket Racing as well so once you do log in tomorrow just expect that speaking of some rewards guys if you do log in right now inside of the game you are going to be getting the uh, bonus style for the Cerberus skin plus some other cosmetics. There was actually a bug, guys, preventing you from claiming this. Uh, these are other cosmetics that you're seeing. So I believe a hotfix was deployed this morning, uh, basically fixing that issue. But move on to some information on Avatar The Last Airbender. We started off today's video with some information from that, guys. The trailer was sick, honestly. I'm going to show it again right here. Leave your thoughts down below of what you actually think. Now, the update that's going to be dropping tomorrow, guys, is going to be leaking everything regarding the event that's going to be starting on April 12th. So all of the cosmetics, all of the mythics are probably going to be leaked, everything related to the collab, and then the event officially starts on Friday. So that's pretty cool right there. It basically says a uh, new shop cosmetics, the new mythics regarding the fire bending, air bending, and also earth bending. You can see Toph doing some sort of like earth bending here uh, in the trailer, Zuko doing some fire bending, Katara water bending. We already know the water bending mythic is in game, so that's not really new. But I think all of these regarding like Zuko and uh, Toph, these are emotes. So there is a possibility we are going to be getting some really cool emotes relating to those skins. So that's pretty cool. Now some other information regarding updates on other weapons is probably going to be turning up in this season. We have battle royale updates, updates on the tactical AR on vault so it's probably going to be unvaulting in like the other updates like another update guys i'm not really sure but this weapon once it actually returns it's going to be similar to the deagle or the hand cannon weapon you can be able to put attachments on it so that's going to be sick considering that weapon was pretty op back in the day continuing on it basically says epic games is changing the bonus quest reward weekly requirements so that was the thing i talked about earlier with cerberus so that's just uh, some updated thing on that aphrodite's uh, snapshot quest is going to be updated as well so be sure to check that out and also some information from save the world recycled traps will now properly give the correct amount of materials back so that's some updated stuff on save the world even though i don't really play it but that's right, guys. So the usuals, the new encrypted files, uh, new cosmetics, new Lego variants, new quests, bug fixes. We got a ton of bugs to be fixed in game. And if I do go to restored reels and see that zipline effect one more time, guys, because there's no zipline like around that area. So that's pretty crazy. You're seeing a zipline. Now, I almost forgot, guys. There was just one rumor that I wanted to mention as well regarding uh, the Kratos skin bundle returning. Now, I'm not really sure if you guys heard this information on Twitter. If you basically, you know, have Twitter. By the way, if you have Twitter, follow me over there. There's a go VYC gaming. There was this information that Kratos is coming back on April the 20th 
Now, why this is actually happening or how some people actually got this date was mainly due to the fact that the Kratos uh, official game, which I believe that one, uh, not the, the old game, but the one regarding Atreus, actually was released on April in 2018. So, I think it's sort of like an anniversary thing, guys, they're basing it off of. Trust me, the community is desperate at this point. Everyone basically wants the Leviathan Axe, so they're just, you know... They're just finding all sorts of stuff, guys. But it's a, it's a cool little little thing, considering, you know, Fortnite does do those types of stuff, guys. Release cosmetics based on anniversaries, like events happening in real life. I uh, remember, like, the Invincible Invincible uh, skins that are possibly now in the Atom Shop. I'm not really sure if they left the Atom Shop. But the Invincible Season 2, like, some other episodes on Invincible Season 2 came out. And Fortnite actually returned uh, the Invincible skins in the Atom Shop. So that's a prime example right there. But I'm not really sure, guys. It's just a rumor at this point. So leave your thoughts and opinions down below. However, guys, with that being said, be sure to drop a like, subscribe, turn on post notification. Code VYCG in the Atom Shop. If you guys want to support me in the Atom Shop, it helps out a ton. But do check out any of these other videos here on screen. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.